Welcome to another Spreadsheeters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spreadsheeters website. In this video, we'll see how to calculate average percentage in Excel. Excel is frequently used for calculations and supports all basic mathematical uh, operations and it has a number of functions that can help you uh, when you're creating formulas. So to calculate the average percentage uh, in Excel, we can use a number of formulas. So we're going to look at two approaches, uh, sorry, a number of functions. We're going to look at two uh, approaches. One is to use the average function, which as the name suggests, uh, computes the mean or the average of a set of numbers. And the second way is to use functions, but then use the uh, mathematical, basic mathematical formula for calculating an average, which is the sum of the numbers divided by the uh, number or the count of the numbers. So let's look at the first way, which is to use the average function. So here I have a set of math scores and I want to find out the average math score to uh, understand how the class is performed. So I will type equals average. So this takes a series of numbers. I can either put a range or a, a number, a series of numbers separated by commas. In this case, my data is organized as a range. So I select that, close brackets, and I have the average. That's the first way. The second way is to use the uh, formula. So I'll say first I need to add up the numbers. I'll do that using the sum function. This also takes a range of numbers or a series of numbers separated by uh, commas and close brackets. So I've got the sum. Now I to get the number of values, I'll use the count function. So the count function counts the number of numeric values in a, a range or a uh, a series of cells. So I'm going to count the number of values here, close brackets and press enter. Now if for any reason since it's counting uh, percentages, this number is displayed as a percentage, you can go to the ribbon and change it into a number by clicking the commas type. Now I'll just use the basic formula for calculating the average, which is the sum divided by the count and say enter and I get the average displayed. These are two ways in which to calculate the average percentage in Excel. Please read the appended article for further guidance.